up network has added a new tax under their weekly tax which you must have to complete the first tax there which is the deployment of your own token before you will be able to do the swapping adding the liquidity and so on which you can see they're all here so now to make sure that you have completed the first tax which will be enable you to be able to participate or complete all these like the swapping and the adding and so on you must have to come up here on that days or on the developer section here you are going to see github just click on it once you just click on it a new page will be open to you where you are going to see there are popular repositories which you can see there is this up underscore 20 that is the template to deploy your own token so just click on it and once you click on it you have to wait for some second for the template to open for you and already you can see it has opened for me and if you look at it here you might get confused seeing all this but don't worry just watch the guide you are going to understand so here is the step-by-step -step guide on how to deploy your own token they say you should install the up uh, chrome extension wallet which you already have it you should obtain the test token which you already have it now the next thing is to download the up 20 templates contract which you just click on it here and it is going to still leave you on that page which shows that you are on the right path so now you can just read all this step by step guide in order to understand as we go you are going to see that they have already given you the process on how you are going to modify the contract which we are going to open it on our code space now to edit it in order to impute your name or the name of your token and also the total supply so making sure that you have downloaded the template here if you click on it it is going to still leave you on that page so now you have to like come up here at the right corner here right top corner here you are going to see where they said use this template and now you have to click on open in a code space so that you'll be able to edit this contract like you'll be able to edit the code to your own test or to how they want you to do it you can see here they are going to show you the uh all these uh these are also guide to read on how you are going to modify the contract code so reading this you still understand so as we go now the next thing is to follow this instruction they say you should open the op20 file which we are already on it the next file to open is src then under src there is contract under contract there is my token.tx so now to open this you come to this left hand side you are going to see there is src so once you just click on it under it they say there will be contracts so click on this contract if you click on it another drop down uh, option will open for you which you can see there is this my token dot so once you just click on my token .ts, the code will be open for you that is where the code is so after clicking it you see now the code has opened now i can modify it to my own test i can change the total supply but you don't have to do that just change the token name then get your file so that you deploy it you can see under this name i will just change this red typed text they said test that's the name of the token just edit it to your own test just write like four letter word or five or anything like that but don't make it long you can see so i just want to make my own aia a card then after making sure i have written the name of the token now i can change the symbol from test to aia as simple as that so once you are able to edit everything just the name just the name that is what you have to edit so after making sure that you have edited it now the next thing is to build this contract that is to run it or to compile it so how are you going to compile it if you go back to the guide if you scroll down they are going to give you where you have to like this particular place to install the dependency and build you have to copy this code just copy it by clicking on the copy button then you come back under this terminal on that terminal there is this place that you are going to paste the code just 
like control-v or anything like that just paste it after pasting it then now you can click on your enter button so just click on enter or press your enter button i mean then you see the code will start running and it is going to compile the contract for you so that you'll be able to get it so you can see it has successfully compiled so now you can see i have successfully compiled the contract and now i can get the file which i'm going to deploy so now if you read the instruction you are going to see that they say you should click on build on that build you are going to see my talking dot w a s m so if you just see this click on it or right click on it to have the uh, download option or you can copy this folder or file you can see i'm just going to download it then if i check my download here you are going to see that it has already downloaded my token contract for me which i compile so now the next thing is to go to the wallet which is the up wallet if you click on it then it is going to open for you that is where you are going to deploy your token looking at this particular place you are going to see there is deploy so just click on deploy then this page is going to open for you and this is where you have to drag or just click on it to open your folders for you so if you click on it they are going to ask you to select where the folder is it is under my download and here it is so i can just click on it to open it on that particular page you can see i'll click on open then now i think my file has already entered so now you can see the deploy button is active for me i can now deploy this token successfully after clicking on it then you see they will tell you to sign the transaction which you have to authorize that by clicking on sign then you wait for some second you see that it is now deploying your token you can see deployment in progress so you have to wait for some seconds or a minute then you are going to receive the success message which you can see payment sent and now i have successfully deployed my token without having any issue so the next thing now is to navigate back to that tax now let me just click on done and you are going to see that already my token has appeared under my tokens that i have in the wallet you can see aia is the name of the token i deployed so now you can see i'll be able to send it to you i'll be able to like do the swapping and so on that they say we should do so now let me just go and check if the tax has been completed i'll navigate back to the page or to the tax section and now i will refresh it like i'm going to scroll down you can see now it has not completed because i did not refresh the page so i'll just scroll down here and click on verify completion and wait for some seconds see how it goes you can see it is loading and now if i scroll down i'll be able to wait to see my point if you know i was having 135 so now let's see what's going to happen okay it has connected now you can see all right it has been added 142,000. now you can see now i have completed this and i was given the 7,000. so that is it we have successfully deployed our up token on the network so now if you want me to show you how to complete the remaining tags make sure you like this video and also comment let me know if you want me to do another video on how to add the liquidity do the swap and so on thank you